All right, here's a little update of the um, Hartley Oscillator uh, single wire transmission, uh, energy transmission. It was um, Illusioner, Illusion 1 asked me uh, one question. It's because he tried to build that circuit, but at his place, he doesn't have an oscilloscope. And if you remember, all I was actually having that wire here uh, tangling and connected to a ground and then I showed you the the wave scope and I'm gonna turn on the light here and watch what watch what will happen if I actually remove my scope uh, from the circuit and the scope is right on the on it's in between the diode and the coil so if I remove it, it stops. The thing is, the oscillator still works perfectly fine. But what happened? I have no idea. Uh, probably in my pile of wire by, back there, I probably create a capacitor with the actual ground of the oscilloscope. Probably do some magic there. I have no idea. But I didn't stop there because, well, the circuit is working and I wanted to see if I can still light up the, the LED from the same voltage and roughly same amperage. And what you actually need to do is to connect the LED directly to the ground. And voila, it works. You can also connect it to the positive, but only two diodes light up. The actually uh, the two light up are actually on the same side. So and the variable capacitor still do its job by varying the intensity, and as soon as the LED go extremely bright, you actually see that ringing effect on the oscillator side so uh, that was just a little update the schematic is still the same so I'm not going to show it uh, any anymore but uh, yep I just wanted to make the uh, little update on that so I hope it uh, I, I hope it clarify uh, some question of people who try to reproduce the circuit and now if I remove my oscilloscope completely off the circuit it still works perfectly and 30 milliamp 44 high brightness LED of course they're not at their maximum but they're still good enough all right thanks for watching